Hey everyone, welcome to your 40 minute cardio and abs crusher workout. You don't need any equipment for this workout, but if you have some of these optional pieces, you can go ahead and pull them out. I'm gonna be using my sliders today for some core work. Like I said, if you don't have them, don't worry about it, but you can also substitute these for something like towels or oven mitts or coloring books, depending on what surface you're working out on. And then the jump rope will be in our second to last circuit today. So if you have a rope, go ahead and pull it out. If you don't, I'll just show you exactly what to do without the rope. We've got two minutes of work at a time today and we're focusing on the same intention for each of those two minutes. So you'll have two minutes of cardio, rest for 15, two minutes of cardio, and then we rest and we switch it up to core. Two minutes of core, rest, two minutes of core, rest. So the endurance focus is heavy in this workout. Make sure you're breathing, make sure your whole pace is let's stay moving, let's not quit. Okay, grab your water, grab your sweat towel, you're gonna love this workout, and let's go ahead and get warmed up. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Heels to glutes. Three, two, one, let's go. Just a quick little one minute warm up here. We're gonna jump right into cardio, so just move your body here with me. Good, rotate side to side. And get your mind right. That's gonna be a great workout. We're just moving together, challenging our core, body weight movements, overhead punch. Okay, and like I said earlier, the focus is to keep going. So if you ever have a moment, you're like, ah, I need to stop and breathe. Stop, that's fine. Just don't quit the workout, don't leave. Just don't even give yourself that option, okay? Jog in place. If you have to stop for three minutes, that's okay. Maybe you skip a whole round of an exercise. Grab water, breathe, just don't leave, okay? Your first move is a high knees times three and freeze. One, two, three. One, two, three. Let's go in three, two, one, let's go. Good, 60 seconds right here. And if you need to make this low impact, obviously step, drive. Okay. There you go. Just get into your zone here. Moving laterally. Don't forget to work your arms. 30 seconds. Last 15. And we're going to go into some punches. Okay. 10 seconds. There you go. Four, three, right here. Two, one. Hook, hook, and up. Hook, hook, punch. There you go. 60 right here. Then we break for 15. Good. And this is also using your core, rotating a little bit. Twenty seconds. Let's get down, let's get down to business. Give you one more night, one more night to get this. We've had a million last eight, seven. Just like this. So let's get down, let's get down to business. One more, two, one, rest for fifteen. You got one more round of those two. Alright? This is your crush it round, okay? So that means turn the tempo up, move a little quicker. All right, we go in four. Let's Big deep down, breath. Down, Three, two, one, let's go. 60 seconds. Maybe you get a little lower, move your feet a little quicker. Good. Last 30, come on, turn it up, Woo. Good, 
15, you go back to your punches. Are you ready? Come on, last little bit here. Four, three, two, one, go. Your tempo is quicker than round one. This is round two, and it's your final round. So make it count. Good. Thirty seconds. Come on. Last fifteen. One more round, come on. Three, two, one. 30 seconds to rest. Grab your sliders if you have them, okay? I'm gonna put them down at the end of my mat here. Exercise one is a plank slider crunch. One and two. Exercise two, you flip it over, those sliders go on your heels. You're crunched, open and close, okay? We go in five. We're already there, I know. You're ready though. Three, two, one, come on. One leg at a time. And if you need to drop down off your hands, just go to your elbows. Modification would be, of course, no slider. Sixty seconds. Breathe deep. Thirty to go. She said that I'm cool. I'm like, yeah, that's true. I believe in G O D. Don't believe it. She keep playing me dumb. I'm a player of a fun. Y'all don't really know my mental. Let me give you the picture like stencil. Falling out in a drought. No flow rain was I'm pouring down. See that. Ten. Get ready to flip over to your back. Support your head. Three, two, one, let's go. Crunch up, open and close. Good, if you don't have sliders, you can obviously just move your legs in and out. This constant crunch is what I want. You're pushing your spine down to the floor. Good job. 30 seconds. If you want to pulse up, think of your shoulder blades coming up. Relax. Up. Relax. Good. Force that tailbone to the floor. Nine. Rest. <sighs> Good job. 15 seconds. We're back over for round two. I know this is a tough one, but I know there's only two rounds. So you got this. Two, one, go. Great job. <sighs> Try to keep thinking of your ribs pulling up, okay? Don't let them reach down to the ground. That's where your abs get relaxed. <sighs> 30 seconds. Exhale. Good. Woo. 15. Feeling the good core connection there? I feel it too. Come on. Work hard. Five seconds. You flip over. Three, 
two, one, flip and go with the canoe open and close. And if you're adding the pulse, pulse it up when your legs open. Good, breathe, shoulder blades up, up. 30 seconds, come on. You're working harder in round two, it's gotta feel like that. Fifteen. Come on, four more. Let's go. Four, three, two, one. Rest for thirty. We're back to cardio. Good job on that one. And you can move your sliders out of the way officially. You're done with them for safety reasons and. <laughs> Maybe just to declutter your area because we have lateral slides up next. Okay? So stepping it out. One, two. Okay? Then after that, snowboard burpees. So you're taking it up and back. When you come up, you're giving me a little tilt here. Okay? And then back to the middle and continue. All right, you ready? We're going in seven. Start with those slides. And then we go into the uh, snowboard burpees. Two, one, and we're off. 60 seconds right here. Make sure you're not dragging your feet, okay? So it's not here. All right, keep it low. Light on your feet. Also, don't cross your feet, so none of this, okay? Open hips, open chest. 30 seconds. Nice work. Come on. 10 seconds. Ready? Pop out of that burpee. And then just give me a little hip twist at the top. Three, two, one, we go down, up. Good job. You can slow that down if you need to. Step it up, step it back. Just give me a little turn. Okay? You're feeling really good. Come out of it and go up quick, okay? Boom, boom. Fifteen. Five. Two. One. Oh. Breathe. One more round. We start back in ten. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Come on. Stand up. Two, one. Come on. It's all about moving. This is when you can kind of catch your breath. You're staying upright. Open your ribs up. Good. There you go. Now keep going. No round two of this one might feel already harder, right? So sometimes progressive overload, let's just push through. It's just don't quit, okay? You're over halfway through this one. Let's go. Yes, come on. 10, snowboard burpees in seven. Come on, big deep breath. 
Last one, two, one, just go. Good, come on. Breathe, I'm with you. You're light on your feet. You're powerful. Your core's turned on because you just did all those plank moves. Your body's ready for this. Just keep going. Fifteen. Don't stop. One more, four, three, two, one, rest. 30 seconds rest. We're going down on the floor for leg raises and reverse crunches. Got your sweat towel, go ahead and put it down. All right, leg raises. Your two options are beginner, one leg at a time. Okay, if you can, go two legs at a time. Exercise two, support your head, bend your knees. You stay crunched, it's here and up. Ready? Let's go. Leg raises. We have 60 seconds, so there's no need to rush. Good form. I like to think of my tailbone kind of working on the posterior rotation. So if I take my belly button and reach for the floor, I wanna keep this feeling. Okay, if it starts to relax and go here, it's no longer working your abs, okay? Keep it flat and rotated back. 30 seconds. To make this tougher, don't come all the way up. Go down, halfway. 15 seconds. Hands behind your head, three, bend your knees, two, one, tap up, crunch. And when you go down to touch your heels on the ground, don't let this happen again, okay? No space here, keep it flat. Thirty seconds. Nice job. Fifteen, and then we'll rest. Keep it drawn back. Breathe. Five. Rest, 15 seconds, grab water. We got one more time through that. You're doing great, stay with me. Come on back, two, one, let's go. And if you wanna make this tougher, like I said, less rest at the bottom here. We're technically at the top, but keep it in the motion. Thirty seconds. Fifteen. Support your head. Two, one. Reverse crunches, let's go. When I say support your head, it's also to get your shoulder blades crunched up, okay? Keep that crunch, that helps your core stay engaged. 
so your lower back doesn't start to take any work. Come on, breathe, I feel you. I know you're doing great, I know you're working hard, I know the sweat is rolling off of you. Or maybe it's just me, but I would bet it's probably not. You got 30 seconds, good reps here. Come on, don't relax your core. 15. Six, five. Two more. And 30 seconds to rest. Come on up to standing. We're going. Standing mountain climbers. And then a kick, jab, cross. Okay, so in 15, you go right here. If you need to slow that down, it's just a knee and a punch. Okay, after that, kick, jab, cross. Same leg for the first round, and then we'll switch second round. Ready, you're doing great, come on. Four, start here. Three, two, one, if you can, turn it up. 60 seconds. Same thing here as with your core. Don't let yourself get ribs flared, okay? Stack, keep it tight. Yes, good job, 30 seconds. Feel free to move around, go side to side. I'm rotating. Fifteen. Light on your feet. Eight seconds. You're gonna kick your right leg. Okay. Four, three, two, one. Right, right, left. Right, right, left. Come on. As you're putting your foot down, jab, same side, cross punch. Good. Good. If you don't feel good about the kick, knee, jab, cross, okay? Just move, 30 seconds. Next round, we'll switch sides. Last 15, we rest. Nice, three, one more, two, one, rest. 15 seconds, good work, grab water. Standing climbers, here we go. Three, two, one, and we're off. Come on, you look great. You look strong, sweaty. Keep moving. I feel it, I know this is not easy, but I know that's why you're here. Not for me to just give you something that's extremely hard, but for you to get stronger through it. Come on. As you get tired, you're gonna wanna go here. Keep it tight. Less than 30. Fifteen. Next round. You're kicking with your left. Eight, seven. Two, one, kick, jab, cross. Let's go. One minute here. Yes, come on. 
Last 30. Then we'll take a 30 second breather. And we're back to core. You're doing fantastic, come on. Don't quit. You are way too deep into this to give up on yourself. Not today. 15. Seven. One more round. Let's go. Three, two, one. Yes. 30 seconds rest. Come on down to your left elbow. You've got side planks. Okay. However you need to cushion your elbow. Side plank on the left side. Most beginner option is here. Knees and elbow. Okay. You can advance it from there. Stay on your knees and go hand. Okay. Next level. Extended legs, highest level, extended legs, straight arm. Pick where you're going. Three, two, one, and we're off. Good job, you're just hanging out here. Think about your body. Shoulder is right over your elbow. Okay, chest is open, so make sure you're not crossed here. Whew. I know this is hard. I feel you, come on. We got this. Knowing that you're there, there doing this with me is really pushing me right now. 15 and you switch sides. Three, two, one, other side, go. Sixty right here. Then we rest. Only two rounds. Sounds better than three, right? Doesn't make it any easier while you're doing it, but mentally, you know you do this one more time each, and we're moving on. Check in with your ribs and your hips right now. If your ribs are pointing in front of you, exhale, tuck them in, okay? Drive your hips up, make sure they're not crossed down. Open them up so your belly button is facing me or facing forward. Legs are strong. You're not sinking into your shoulder. You're pushing the floor away from your head. And you're driving your hips up for eight more seconds, come on. Two, one, oh yeah. Breathe. Whew. One more round each. Hop off your hands for a second. We go again in five. Three, two, one, and we're back. Breathe deep. <laughs> Beautiful job. You're over halfway through this one. 30 seconds to go. Come on. Good work, come on, come on. Breathe deep. Eight, don't drop yet. Not yet, not yet. Two, one, flip. Come on, good transition. Get there, get there. Hips are reaching for the sky and you are incredibly strong. Believe that, come on. Three, 
30 seconds. Fifteen. Don't drop. Do not drop. Come on, come on, come on. Up, up, up. Four. Two, one. Rest. Oh, my Lanta. 30 seconds. Grab your jump rope if you've got it. Okay, we're just gonna do regular jump. Skip on the first one if you don't have a rope. It's so right here, use this motion. Then you're gonna lay your rope down in the shape of a V. Okay, and you're gonna go agility over top. Okay, so jump rope, we start in five. Get your rope, come on, come on, come on. Three, two, one, just go. Start skipping. We've got this cardio circuit and a core circuit and you're done, okay? That's how close we are to being finished. Focus, breathe. Good, light on your feet. Thirty seconds. You're just gonna lay the rope down. If you don't want to worry about the rope, just give me lateral skips, side, middle, side. Fifteen. Four, three, two. One, let's go. Side, middle, side. Working your arms. Yes, good job. You're here because I know you want more for yourself. You got 30 seconds and we rest. Don't forget why you showed up today in the moments where this gets really tough. Great job. One more round through that. Okay. Here we go. 60 seconds of skipping. Two, one, and we're off. Last two minutes of cardio. Light on your feet. As soon as the rope crosses your face, skip, skip, skip. Or if you're doing another form of cardio, just keep moving. Thirty seconds down. Can you sprint a little bit for me here? I think you can. Come on. Fifteen. Go, go, go. Seven, go, go, five, three, two, rope down, move, 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 let's go. Light on your feet, quick on your toes. Arms are moving. Thirty. Come on. Life is too short to last. 
Don't slow down for 12. Yes, come on. Light, 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 quicker, quicker, five. Three, two, one. 30 seconds rest. Good job. Woo. We've got core and you've made it, okay? Single leg suitcases and frog sit-ups. Come on down to your back, okay? One leg is out. Coming up and out, okay? That's round one. Round two will obviously be the opposite leg. Frog sit-ups, soles of your shooters are together. You're here. Two, one, let's go, come on. And if you wanna step it up, your flat leg or the leg that's not crunching in can float. Fifteen. Four, three, soles of your shoes together. Two, one, sit up, let's go. You can use your hands to help you up. Swing a little bit, kind of diagonal forward. Okay, if you want to make this tougher, thumbs are beside your ears. Something that helps me is thinking of pushing my shoes into the mat. Okay, right before I go. 30 seconds. Fifteen. Six, five, two, one. Oh yeah. Fifteen seconds rest. We got one more round of those two and you've made it. We're cooling down. Come on. So the other leg crunches in. We go in three, two, one. Come on. Make this a little quicker. Maybe don't sit up here so long, right? Tap your low back, crunch, tap, crunch. Keep that crunch. Thirty seconds. Fifteen. Seven. Get ready, frog. Sit up. Three, two. One, let's go. Frog or butterfly, or externally rotated knees, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> let's go. Control it down, so if you're slamming down, work on that, okay? Slow, think of your spine as a sticker. You peel it off, and then starting with your tailbone, you put it back down. Thirty seconds, come on. Five, give me two more. Three, two, one, 
and flip over. We're gonna close it out with 15 burpees. I'm totally kidding. You made it to your cool down. <laughs> oh, hopefully that made you smile for a quick second. Oh my gosh, I feel that one. I feel that with you. Hands and knees. Big inhale, exhale, let your belly drop. Again, one more. Drop your hips down. Beautiful work today. Oh, that was not easy. Tuck your toes, lift your hips up. Look back at your toes. Try to walk back until you can get your heels on the ground. So proud of you today. If you're here right now and you did not quit, you absolutely crushed this cardio and abs crusher. Okay, I knew this one was gonna be tough. Walk back to your toes. So I knew in your mind you were gonna have to get through it. Okay, bend your knees slowly, slowly, slowly roll up to the top. Long work periods, very short rest periods. Push forward gently on your tailbone. And this is what tier number one in summertime fine is all about, okay? Shift your hips out to the left, open your left arm up and over. You should feel that right here. This first tier is about getting your conditioning improved, right? Going through this workout, it was basically about just don't stop. Keep moving and breathe through it. It was gonna be tougher if your breathing was short, shallow, really elevated really quickly. Shift sides. Okay, this one was about breathe slow and deep. Keep your heart rate as low as you can while pushing hard. But I knew throughout the workout, progressively, it was potentially gonna be that place where you thought, this is ridiculous. This is hard. This is tier number one, okay? All these things that are really tough right now will get better. And they will help us in tier number two and in tier number three especially, okay? But this is the preseason conditioning kind of. This is that tough part where it just feels tough, okay? Cross your arms over your chest. There's no way around it. You have to put in some work in order for any of this to get easier. In order to see progress, you're not just walking up to the plate and heading home runs. You're swinging, you're swinging, you're swinging, and you're not stopping. That's what tier number one, and this workout especially, as you can feel, was all about, okay? You build and you go through tough things to get better, and those tough things aren't tough forever. But if you quit when they are tough, then they will be, right? Don't stop. When it's hard, you push harder. When it's hard, you say, I can dig deeper. When it's hard, you stop doubting yourself and just say, I'm giving what I've got. And what I have is the ability to not give up. No matter what it looks like, I keep fighting. I keep swinging, okay? And you did that today. If you're here right now, be proud of that and keep this going. Outside of the workout, I don't want you to stop this mindset. Eat well, hydrate, get some sleep, and take care of your mental health. I'll see you back here for tomorrow's workout. Don't forget to make sure you're subscribed to the channel. So proud of you today. I'll see you tomorrow.